Richo? Well, I thought Gatsby's is the obvious for what we saw in all the form references that you've referred to. Um, he is short in the market, though, so the great play at fixed price around $17 for mine was parkour. Those blinkers going on, by gee, I think he's going to run a big race today. So the Pago Pago, he won the Golden Slipper on a Wednesday in 1963. It was so wet on the Saturday. What a horse. I remember him well, uh, being a South Australian. I watched a lot of his early racing. He had 10 starts as a two-year-old for nine consecutive wins. He went to America. He's in the best five or six Golden Slipper winners of all time. Freakish. He went to Melbourne and broke the Australian record for a two-year-old over 1,200 and then smashed time and tide in that famous Golden Slipper. Here we go. Here in the Pago Pago, stand by Gatsby's the short price favourite. Ready to go. And they're racing. A note began brilliantly wide out. And handle bars down. A note's looking for the lead from the wide draw coming across the field. Gatsby's there with Dublin down. Johnny the Kid wide out. The 300 handy on the rails, followed then by Coleman. On the outside, a King of Rousseau, a gap to agenda set of parkour. Well back then is uh, well back glorious moments. And Duvana going into the first turn. And Dublin down got to up on the inside there and held out a node for the lead. Dublin down from a node. Johnny the Kid out wide, followed by the 300. And Gatsby's is wedged between runners in fifth as they come to the turn. King of Rousseau getting close to heels on the inside of Coleman and two further back to agenda setter. Dublin down comes to the bend in front by a length. A node under pressure. They're followed by the 300. Gatsby's into the clear from Johnny the Kid. King of Rousseau's got it all to do. Inside the 300 metres, Dublin down the leader. Going well from a node. Gatsby's grinding away in third. He needs to lift. It's Dublin down in front of the 150. A length on a node sticking to the task. But Dublin down going great guns. Dublin down is going to gate crush the golden slipper. Dublin down held off a node and Coleman got up to run third. Gatsby's not so great in fourth. Then came King of Rousseau. Further back to parkour from Johnny the Kid, the 300. A gap to Devana, agenda setter. At last to finish was glorious moments. Good line though, Darren. Even he finished fourth, you collected that oh so well. Well, boy, oh boy, if the previous winner made not a big effect on the market for the Golden Slipper, you feel like this bloke's not going to as well. He must have been at least 200 to 1. 3, 4 and 1. Coleman was good and O's run well. Dublin down was just fantastic for the Macca boys, wasn't he? Yeah, great to see them. Obviously, they've had some great two-year-olds in their time, but to see this horse ridden so aggressively, of course, by one of the best front-running riders that we have here in Sydney, Tim Clark, put this horse up on speed, never gave anything else a chance. I think they just had everything out of their comfort zone the entire race. I thought a node was 